Yeah, uh, good morning. I get a visitor in a moment, so I'll keep it short. Nope. Um, a law of attraction. At this moment, it's very popular. Uh, one of the things that says uh, the secret, and um, uh, it, it, it uh, involves the law of attraction. Is there a law of attraction? Yes, there is. But it's not as you think it is. And if you really know, realize what it was, you would not want it. There is a law of attraction. Um, if you uh, uh, apply this law of attraction, then you, you can get anything you like. Anything. That's true. But in the meanwhile, and you see that a lot of, that's a lot of influence from the, the pop music, maybe, maybe in the early days of the pop music, uh, in the meanwhile, you have sold your soul to the devil. The devil can get you anything you like. But in the meanwhile, the devil has you, has the right to, to get you in hell. And um, the most people don't realize that uh, uh, God, Jesus Christ, can give you also what you need. Not necessarily what you want, but what you need. But then you ask it in Jesus Christ's name. And if you don't do that, and if you uh, apply the law of attraction, um, then there is another source who's going to deliver you what you want. But in the meanwhile, you're a slave to that, to that power. And that power is from the devil. The devil can get you anything you want. Um, there is a, a passage in the Bible where Jesus is tempted by the devil in the desert. And um, uh, the devil at that moment takes Jesus to a, a high place above the earth. And he says, I can give you everything, the glory of all these kingdoms, he shows to Jesus the world. I can give you everything, all the glory of this entire world. Because it has been given to me. And I can give it to who I, who I want. That's what the devil says. And he's right at that moment, at that, that point. And, um, but Jesus says, and the, the devil says, you only have to bow for me. You only have to recognize me as God. So at that moment, Jesus could get ahead of the world if he would bow down to, to the devil. But Jesus says, only God deserves the worship. So I'm not going to bow down to you. So he, he doesn't get it. Um... The devil realized that at that moment that Jesus was coming to conquer the world and to take back the world. Yeah? So the devil offered him that. He said, well, you can have it if you bow down to me. Well, that's what's happening actually today. So the law of attraction, yes, you can have what you want if you bow down to, to, to the devil. That's what's happening actually. And that is the law of attraction in all those kinds of uh, things. It's, it's like witchcraft. It's the same source. It's the same principle, etc. Um, and I have some, some personal experiences in my life and in my parents' life that it's really true that this happens. Um, but unfortunately, this is from the devil. You can ask God, Jesus Christ, uh, 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 what you want. And if he thinks that you need it, then you can get it. That's true. But then you apply to Jesus Christ himself. If you don't apply to, if you don't ask Jesus Christ, then it's automatically from the other source. Okay, that's the law of attraction uh, revealed and opened. Okay, that's what I wanted to share with you. Okay, bye.